Now that we've heard from the peanut gallery, let's hear from a real adult. You kiss your mother with that mouth? Because I'm going to kiss all your mothers with my mouth later tonight. And I'm not talking on her mouth lips. Not my mom, no way. That's all you got? That's all you got? Take a sex ed class, then you'll know what the fuck I meant. Speaking of pussy, since you two seem to be bosom buddies already, forget the triple front match, let's just make this a handicap match, all right? Because even with you two against me, you're still in a deficit. Ring the bell. Well, I guess we are underway. This uh, triple threat match. It's turned into a handicap match, according to C.J. O'Doyle. Yeah, C.J. O'Doyle against uh, Ariel Monroe and, and uh, Alley Cat, who actually believes she's a cat. The debut of Alley Cat here at Fest Wrestling. Aria Blake has joined us here on commentary. Yeah. And uh, Aria, good to see you. Good to see you guys. I'm sorry that it has to be during a C.J. O'Doyle match. You see uh, C.J. there just sliding in that gift in his arm, able to break the count. How are you feeling, Aria? It's been a while. Last time we saw you, He's got gifts for everybody, but C.J. O'Doyle basically dropped you on your head on the ring apron. Uh, yes, he did. Um, you know, it's been a couple months. I'm feeling better. I'm feeling stronger. You know, done lots of physical therapy. Got my shoulder where I wanted to be, my head where I wanted to be. Um, I've just got a couple months. Oh, 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 oh. Look at that. That's a hell of a I gift. I mean, like, that's a nice gift, but you know that's C.J. Like, you know there's bad intentions. Well, Allie Cat seems to be enjoying the uh, ball of yarn. Oh, boy. I mean, if she's happy, good, but just exactly. Oh. There it is. Well, you knew as soon as that yarn went, uh, went flying, the cat was going to go chasing it, right? Now Ariel Monroe is going to unwrap this uh, large gift. What do you think's in there? What's in the box, right? Yeah, what's Something in the box? Something else I, disappointing. I know we'll find out later on what's in the box. What's in that box? Yeah, what's in there? Yeah, I don't know. A manila envelope. Well, Alley Cat has found the yarn. What is Ariel Monroe? Uh, what's her gift here? Oh, a signed uh, CJ a sign. o o O'Doyle 8 by 10 can also pick those up in the uh, merch table. Oh, oh. It's, not, it's not signed yet. He's going to sign it now. Well, that's very... A real pro pre-signs their stuff so they have more time to talk to the fans, but okay. Oh. So we cut you off, though. You're feeling better, right? Oh, yeah. I'm feeling better. I'm feeling much better after seeing that. Yeah, I'd, I'd imagine that would liven your spirits a little bit, seeing it, an autographed picture of CJ, CJ O'Doyle ripped up and thrown away. Totally. Well, this match is underway. I don't know what the hell's going on right now. The bell rang a while ago. Got more gifts? Oh, I, well, I apparently It is got... Christmas in July. It is. Aria, you didn't take part in the white elephant, did you? Well, uh, no, I didn't. CJ has a gift of his own that he's opening. Yeah. And, uh... What is that? What is that? It's a, a can of whoop ass. And there we go! Fez Press gets things underway, and Ariel Monroe's had it up. And Big Swole starting this one up. Whoa! Yeah, yeah, hey. Aria's over here uh, selfieing herself as this match goes on. I am recording women beating a man's ass. Ariel into the cover, and O'Doyle out at two. Alley Cat making her way into the ring. Do you know this Alley Cat? Yes, I do. She, she really believes she's a cat, huh? Yeah, and I mean, to each their own. I prefer dogs, but you know, I think she's harmless. She's a nice cat. Yeah, you know, we all know that person who just really, whoa, back sent on there by Alley. Gotta go for the cover. 
CJ on it too. We all know somebody who's a little, little too into their cats, Max, right? Well, me and you are cat people, Rich. We are. Shout outs to Orville Kattenbacher back in Pittsburgh, PA, my homeboy. Listen to this, they're getting the meow chant going. Good for them. Look at this picture here of my cat. Yeah, I mean, you know. I've met your cats, your cats are great. But I mean, this Alec cat takes it to a whole, uh, whole other level, This right? is the first time I'm watching a cat wrestle in a oh. professional wrestling match. <laughs> CJ O'Doyle rolls to the outside. Alley Cat and Ariel Monroe. Big Soul gonna fly. Thought she was gonna wind up instead, little uh, little slide there. And just talk. <laughs> now, what were you saying to CJ when you came out here? I mean, I saw the middle fingers. What were you saying though? Um, I think it was just generally along the lines of just talking shit, you know. Oh, a scaredy cat. We got a scaredy cat. Rich. Oh, fair enough. She's got nine lives. She should use them. It's a family show here, Aria. We can't talk like that. Uh, we cuss. I feel uh, like fair. nobody here can have a family. <laughs> Why not? They just shouldn't. They're, they're incapable, incapable of being uh, family people is what you're saying. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't know. Just maybe people shouldn't breed. Wow. And right now the table has turned. CJ O'Doyle has taken control of this match. Has CJ O'Doyle always had that thing on his back? I'm sorry? Has he always had that back, like, tattoo, whatever it is? Uh, what does he have on there? Is that like a flying eagle or something? I don't know, but it looks Whoa. like a midlife crisis. Was that for me or for you? I'm assuming it was for you, Aria. Uh, Sunset flip here and O'Doyle. Oh! I mean, he pointed over at the announce table. He wasn't pounding, pointing at you, Max. I was don't he? think he has any beef with me. Rich. I don't know. I mean, you never know with this guy. How are you going to call yourself a man, though, and just feud with all the girls? It ain't going to be me. Yeah, this is a handicap matchup. It was supposed to be a triple threat. And O'Doyle, yeah, I mean, he came out and said, yeah, I'm a man. I'm a big, burly man. CJ O'Doyle calls himself hardcore. Perhaps he thinks he's got the upper hand in this one. Looking for a little more competition. So, Aria, what are your plans for CJ o o O'Doyle here going forward? I mean, it, you, you clearly have issues with him. When do you think you're going to be uh, you're going to be back in action? Oh yeah, totally have issues back in action. Um, you know, I don't think I'm going to be here in September, but I think I got uh, October 28th pretty open. You know, we are family. October 28th is my 30th birthday. Is it really? Yeah. Oh. oh, congrats. I just turned 24 on Wednesday. You're just a young kid. Hey, you know. We all are. I think having Aria Blake back in Fest Wrestling for my birthday is a great present. Yes. I think Aria Blake being back at Fest and being here to just bother CJ O'Doyle, I like it. Well, I mean, that's it. What the hell just happened? What does he do? Does he have a la he had a laser pointer? Oh, yeah, you know, cats and laser pointers. Yeah. So, uh... Oh. Well, there's the tag to Ariel Monroe. Big swole. O'Doyle will miss with the double oh. axe handle. Ariel Monroe, quite the connection on CJ O'Doyle, and he is dazed right now. And she's still talking smack. You gotta love the attitude. Oh! Little acrobats from Monroe. CJ again rolling to the outside. That's smart. Take a breather if you got to take a breather. And the action has made its way outside the ring. Of course, we've grown accustomed to that here at Fest Wrestling. Fast and loose with the rules, Max. We sure are, Rich. What is this? <laughs> I don't know what's happening right now. I hope there's a weapon. Uh-oh. They're gonna double suplex. CJ yes! on the outside, right on the floor. We love that. We love a good suplex on the floor. They're 
digging under the ring for something. Maybe some more presents or cat toys, perhaps. What are they looking for? Could be looking for anything. Huh. Perhaps uh, may maybe a door, a kendo stick, a, a cat scratcher, maybe? I well, here's CJ. A couple of chairs in the ring here, Max. And Alley Cat using her cat claws to the eyes of CJ O'Doyle. <laughs> what do they have in mind here? Huh. What the hell are you doing? Looks like they made a little bridge with those two chairs. Rude. Look at that weak shit. O O'Doyle. You ever step on your cat's paw? Oh, I have. They yeah. do not like that. They were. Ah! Right? Uh... Well, Alley Cat appears to uh, have done herself in right there. movement I've created. Big Swole, Big Swole, do it. Oh Yay! Oh my god! Vicious, yes! Vicious power bomb. Into the cover! Uh -oh. Somehow O'Doyle powers out. Not quite enough. Ariel Monroe, I thought that was it. CJ O'Doyle somehow kicks out at two. And he's making his way to the outside. Uh, Ariel grabbing hold of CJ. Referee uh, Frank Gassino out there is O'Doyle pulling up the uh, the ring apron. We got Dirty Dancing. Uh oh, oh, come on! And she did not see that one coming. No, you gotta be kidding me! What a piece of shit! O'Doyle gets the win. He stole it. Here is your winner. wasn't looking and he poked Ariel in the eyes. And Aria Blake is upset with the outcome of this one. Oh! What the hell is that? Come on! O'Doyle hawking a loogie. Oh, uh oh. I think she just spit on the chair too. not see that one coming. <laughs> it's CJ O'Doyle laid out by the uh, team. Yeah, well, you're talk shit. I heard you call yourself the Aria Blake Assassin. Well, you know what I think of that? I think after many, many months of shoulder physical therapy, after many months of you dropping me on my head, I will be back October 28th. So we are family. How about we have ourselves a little match? The challenge has been made. Better say now, bitch. Whoa. Oh. Well, Aria Blake has challenged C.J. O'Doyle, and Aria told us she was going to be back in October. Let's we'll see if Tony makes this happen. October 28th, we might be seeing Aria Blake versus C.J. O'Doyle. Aria Blake, welcome back to Fest Wrestling. We just saw you challenge C.J. O'Doyle. Uh, what are your immediate thoughts following this? My immediate thoughts on C.J. O'Doyle. The Aria Blake assassin, right? The man that needs my name in his mouth for relevancy? CJ, you want a match at We Are Family? How about this? I will show you how hardcore this bitch can be. I will show you what... Ah! Move! Ah! What the hell was that out there? Speechless.
useless, huh? Typical. Last time we saw you, I put you on the shelf. You want to challenge me to something hardcore? You don't know hardcore! Hardcore to you is going out in public without makeup on. Next time we're in the same ring together, it's going to be fans bring the party weapons. We are a family, and I'm going to finish the job. You've never finished a girl in your life. 